Very pleasant good day, my beloved brothers and sisters in Christ and outside the body of Christ. Once again, this is your Christian brother Eric Braxton speaking to you all from his beloved country, Trinidad and Tobago, the land of my nativity, the land of my birth, Trinidad and Tobago, this wonderful island country that is the Caribbean Sea, speaking to you all the month of November. This will be a short three minutes video, my dear brothers and sisters, because I'm limited on space on my phone, brothers and sisters. Um, I'm reaching out to my atheist brothers with my right, with my Christian right hand of fellowship onto them, teaching them the truth. Richard Hawkins, my learned, my brother, and um, we're saying, nah, I recording something. Richard Hawkins and um, Alex O'Connor and Jenny Bells, Jenny Bells from the atheist community in Texas and United States of America. I want you all to know that you all are preaching the wrong gospel. I, Eric Braxton, and the Church of God, the Saints of God, the Christians everywhere, the true Christians are preaching the right gospel, the gospel of the Kingdom of God, the Holy Bible, what Christ commissioned us to preach. God consciousness, God experience, that God is in charge of the universe. As I said, God put, God put so much abundance of things down here to know, to prove, to show unto us that He exists. For instance, let's look, let's examining all the trees alone will tell us God exists. But to you all, that doesn't, that is not enough. Because you all have all the evidence in front of you, the physical universe, and to show that God exists. But you all are saying the, there's no evidence that God exists. The physical creation is is the evidence that God exists, whether you all accept it or not. But since you all refuse it, it will remain that way, and you all cannot change it. Richard Dawkins and Alex, and Alex O'Connor and Jesse. Jesse Bell, my little sister. I, Eric Braxton, is not asking God, the Father, neither Jesus Christ, to show me any new thing that he exists. Because he put enough stuff down here for that he know to exist. All the birds, all the batrack, all the cockroach, all the crocodiles. It is intelligently designed by God. And that is enough for, for I to know that he exists. Ah, I want you all to know that. And since I know that, I'm teaching these lessons to you all so that you all become conscious of God. Or you all want to see God to know that He exists. Oh, well, God is invisible. And until He makes Himself visible for all to see, you all will have to show patience and wait. I am showing patience and wait until that time come. Uh -huh. I am not forcing God to appear before me visible for Him to show Himself to me. Ah, that's what you all want and looking for. Well, unfortunately to say, you all will not see that until Jesus Christ come and appear to all mankind. Yes, until that time, if you all live, you all have to wait. And of course, if you all die before the time, you will resurrect you all. And in judgment, you all will stand before him. Ah, so we all have to wait. And we will not force his sons. Ah, keep in mind that his sons are solely righteous. And let me remind you, he's always on time. We might find that he's coming too late. To show himself visible to us well whether we live to when he come or whether we die when he come it will be the right and appropriate time it's time you all learn that lesson i have learned it whether the easy way the hard way i have learned it and now i'm teaching you all that teaching you all that so wake up to that reality wake up to that baby culture in the mighty name of jesus christ amen and amen shalom peace see you all in the next video soon bye bye my friends